This week's parasha Ki Tavo, the Jewish people have come to Eretz Yisrael. One of the first mitzvot that they do is they take all the blessings that they have in their field, the grapes, the figs, the pomegranates, they put them all in a basket, they bring them up to Yerushalayim in order to give thanks to Hashem. There's an incredible thing going on here. Hashem has given us everything and we are giving thanks back. Sometimes we think that somebody has given to me and I say, thank you. But actually when you think about it, we're giving thanks. Why are we giving thanks? Why don't we just say thanks? Thank you. I think an answer can be, is that actually when you give to somebody else, you're forming a relationship. Somebody gives something to me, I give thanks to them. I'm not just saying thanks, cheers, good one. I'm giving thanks because thanks is a relationship. It's like love, which is two way. If only one side loves and the other one doesn't, there's nothing there. Life is about give and take, but the take can also be give if you're giving thanks. So when a person gives to me and I give thanks to them, they're getting something back, a real genuine smile, a thank you note, an appreciation, and they want to give more, give more to me and I want to give more to them. And that's why giving really is a circle, giving and taking, giving and taking, giving and taking, building a world of giving, the gift that keeps on giving. Quite a few years ago, uh, the world went through a big downturn. Everybody's business was doing badly. It happened to be actually I was in hospital. I was very unwell at the time, but I really wanted to, I wanted to give thanks. I wanted to express a deep thank you to people who had helped us out over many years and really made a difference. And I thought the best way of doing that was to put together a little scrapbook. This is actually it. And it's called The Thank You Book. And it ended up being much bigger than I thought. It was a whole book, sharing with people, the wonderful gifts that they had given, I felt that I wanted to give thanks back. In this week's portion, God himself, as it were, asks us to come up with our first fruits and express thanks. When that expression is real, when we are telling what a difference it makes in our life, when we are relating our history, this is where we come from, this is where we've been, and this is how much we appreciate the fruit and the blessings that we have in life then we are forming a relationship with Hashem Himself. When we give thanks to people who help us, who give to us, then they're not just giving to an anonymous person. If it, whatever it is, money or time, just giving in, goodbye. When we express thanks, we are building a relationship. Be great. Be a giver. Give thanks. Shabbat Shalom.